A scary moment for Gladewater ISD students this morning on the way to school. Their bus ran off the road and crashed into a tree. KTK's Frank Jefferson was at the site of the accident today and walks us through exactly what happened. Broken windows, mangled tires, and a chunk missing from the hood. School bus accidents are a parent's worst nightmare. Thursday morning, those fears came true. We got a call for a uh, bus wreck on Coach Cooksey at Loop 485. The accident happened as Gladewater Middle School students were on their way to school. According to the Texas Education Agency, this isn't some freak accident. There were almost 1,900 school bus accidents reported across the state during the 2016-2017 school year. But a state law trying to keep students safe is requiring lap seat belts on all new buses purchased by school districts. With seat belts now, uh, especially with elementary students, uh, if they have trouble undoing the seat belts, then we have to go through with cutters and cut them out, and it could delay some of our evacuation. KTK News hasn't verified if the Gladewater bus has seat belts or not. I want to show you the path that the bus took. We got tire tracks here that have lasted for hours that lead up to this tree that's been toppled over and almost completely uprooted. Now, after talking with one of the firefighters who was on the scene, he says he's thankful that some of the children only had minor injuries because something like this could have been a lot worse. Head bumps, a little bit of a laceration on their head, just where they, you know, came forward and, and hit their heads on the seats. So, but um, everything was relatively minor. The best advice during these types of dangerous situations is to stay seated and buckled up if that's an option. Frank Jefferson, KETK News. Still no word tonight on what caused the driver to crash, but when the police department releases more information, we'll update you on our website, KETK.com.